So now that we've got books and teaching or education and work experience listed in chronological order, the next thing that might be nice to add are listing some of the skills that you have. So I want you as a challenge to create a table where you've got an H3 for the skills uh, subtitle, and then you've got all your skills listed in a column on the left. And on the right, you've got some rows where you've listed using emojis to show how familiar you are with each skill, ranging from five star to one star. Once you're done, you should have a website that looks something like this. So you've got your H3 as a subtitle, and then you've got a table that lists your skills as well as the number of stars that you would rate yourself. And to get bonus points, you can also use tables to affect the layout of your skills so that you end up separating your skills into two columns and making it look a little bit like this. And this is what you should end up with, or rather, this is what you're aiming for. So I've added an extra skill so that we have four skills and they are laid out side by side so that there's two columns of these skill sets. And it's really important to note these two sections should be distinct from each other. So if you added a one pixel border, this is the structure that you will see. Two sets of skills side by side, distinct from each other. So if you want to give that challenge a go, then this is a good time to pause the video and give it a try.